President-elect Donald Trump's nominee for Defense Secretary back on Capitol Hill today. He's meeting with lawmakers as he fights to win their support. ABC's Perry Russell is in Washington. Mr. Hexat, do you believe you have support from Republican senators to be confirmed? Fighting, we're ready to go. Today, Pete Hexeth fighting to remain President-elect Trump's nominee for Secretary of Defense. Sources tell ABC News Trump's team has not been working the phones for him, something he did for Matt Gates when his nomination for Attorney General was wrapped in controversy. We're fighting all the way through the tape. We're grateful to have the president's support because uh, his vision for this Department of Defense is to bring it back to its core capacity. Hegseth continuing his carousel of meetings at the Capitol with Republican senators working to win over their support ahead of any confirmation hearing. I've got a completely open mind. I'm going to do everything I can to make sure he's confirmed as the Secretary of Defense. Sources tell ABC News Trump's team is focused on figuring out where female Republican senators stand. Senator Joni Ernst on Fox News. It doesn't sound on your answer that you've gotten to a yes. If I'm wrong about that, correct me. Um, and if that is the case, it sounds to me as if the hearing will be critical um, for his nomination. Am I right about that? I think, I think you are right. I think for a number of our senators, they want to make sure that any allegations have been cleared. Today, Elon Musk meeting with lawmakers about Trump's newly created Department of Government Efficiency, DOGE for short. Musk is co-leading the outside agency with Vivek Ramaswamy. It's designed to reduce government waste. In their immediate sites, remote work policies for federal employees. House Speaker Mike Johnson calls today's meetings brainstorming sessions. One of the first things that I think you'll see is a demand from the new administration and from all of us in Congress that federal workers return to their desks. House Speaker Mike Johnson says the size and scope of the government has just grown far too large. He says it does too many things and nothing well, adding taxpayers deserve better. Perry Russell, ABC News, Washington.